What is up guys and welcome back. It is the Robert Player HD here and we are here with episode 10 of my London Irish career mode. And our internationals still aren't back. Yeah, it's one more week and then they're back. But see we are playing London Welsh and I'm not sure where they're on the table. They're doing right. But we have an awful start. Marlon Yard. Our top try scorer. Gets injured. It was absolutely gutting seeing that I had to bring him off. We do bring some guy called Sa. It's like SA, I have no idea how to pronounce it rather. Just absolutely dominates the first guy who comes up against. He's gonna pass out of school. Do go wide anyway. Anthony Watson does score. Where probably Mon rather would have as well. It did go to TMO but I still did score it. Um and I got the conversion as well. And then maybe the easiest tries to score in this game are when to a free man, let's go off, let's score. So he's to score then. So the as well. um, So we have a nice lead going there, 14 0. Well, it would be 14 0. I don't know what I'm sure um, yeah, and we do get that conversion as well, so that's 14 0. And we are going down on them, to be honest. I need to get that bonus point so we can get a little bit closer to this one. To beat the next episode. Uh, Jonathan Joseph, Lance Evans, out to OJ. OJ tries to step, just gets tackled. Get the ball back. Go down the blind side, gives a nice pass. Tackles, ends off one, goes in. That's 19 more. Pretty well, so. Then we have another chance. Topsy Ojo. It's a little kick. Picks it up. It's going to score. No, it gets dri driven back past the line. It's not going to do that. But, um. <coughs> sorry. Um, we do get the ball again. To go wide. Shingler. Out to Joseph. Out to Evans. And then to Watson. We just score again. That's 26 now, and we do convert that as well. No, we don't, sorry. No, we don't. Um, we do give away a soft driver. Doesn't really mean anything for them though, because they're going to get a bonus point. So we've got the bonus point. Um, and it's a great run from the new man, Sa, who I was really impressed with, so I actually uh, put him in the squad for the next game. Release! As well. Very impressive he was. Uh, anyway, we do <laughs> we do get the ball in midfield. Definitely down here. Out to Sa. I don't have to say it. I'll just say Sa. And then Topsy OJ waves goodbye. And then scores under the posts. Scoring another try. It's brilliant. So, 40 to 7. That is an absolute great result there. Um, and you see, we have to take off Martin Yard and put Guy Armitage back in because we have all of our internationals back. And I do decide I want to put Sat in, like I was saying before. And I put him in for Anthony Watson because he was he played brilliantly last game. And I think he's going to be a really good player to have in the centres. And I think he's a four year contract. Didn't even realise that before. I thought he was like a loanee or something, but actually, he's a four year contract. Um, yeah, he's quite old, so he might retire though, but I'm not sure about that. Anyway, um, do come against Gloucester here, and I wanted to get another bonus point here so we can get closer to Worcester. But you see, it doesn't, doesn't go to play. Early on, good try from Dan Robson, who if you didn't know in this game is 12. I don't know if that's for everyone, but for me, he's 12 years old, uh, which of course isn't right. He's like 20 something, but <laughs> yeah, on my game he's 12. If you want me to show you that, feel free to comment it. But um, yeah, he's 12 on mine. I don't know how that works. Um, you know, we get good player in midfield. Sa, I'm just gonna say Sa instead. It's probably like Sa or something, but I'm just call him Sa. Um, good pass out to Top Zero Joe. <coughs> just go in and score a good try. 
and then we do go the worst round. We they go wide. Lost it, and I'm surprised they did so well against me because their players are addicted to the power in this game. But that was a great line, though. An absolutely brilliant line to score that try, and it is 12 7. I was being quite scared. Um, but we do get a chance to give a nice pass. Steve Schindler goes into the post to make it 14 0. More vehicles can go, it's easy. 14 0. <coughs> But straight from the kickoff, pretty much, Dan Wilson just goes for drop kick. Just like randomly, it's like, yeah, go for it. It's like that um, Leeds game that happened recently, uh, the league, uh, Leeds Rhinos, where. No, it wasn't Leeds, it was Wigan, I think. But got the ball at the halfway line, just like, Advantage! So, no much better up in the league, but that's pretty much the only game I've watched this year. But anyway, we were trying to get the try at the end of the game, and we knocked it on. Yeah, that's absolutely gutted. So I wanted to, I, I didn't want to take the drop goal, I wanted the win because I needed the win. But we do lose against Gloucester there. Anyway, um we are playing against Leicester here, so this is first place, so this should be a tough game. But it didn't end up like that. You see early on, the easiest way to score tries. Uh to the front man. That's a nice pass. Thomas O'Leary goes in and scores. What a surprise. And then, you see here, we you get the ball, and we do the same thing. And, <coughs> just about to be half time, but give it to Thomas O'Leary. There's more to do this time. Nice little dummy. Goes to the side of his man, and then goes under the posts. So that's another good scrum after. This one was a bit better than the last one. But, pretty much straight from the kickoff. This, this, this is the fastest try after half time I've ever seen. Stretch tops the Ojo. Scrum off scared of him like ever. Sorry, didn't scrum off. Fullback scared of him. Everyone's scared of him. The Ojo is too good. Um, but yeah, that's the fastest try I think I've scored. Should be challenge Touch. two this year. Set. Um, and we do get. I want to get this bonus point. 21 0 up against Burns and This will be the first loss this season. I think it'll be them, I think. If it is, I'm sorry about that. Might be second. But um, do go wide. Sa, great pass out to Guy Armitage who goes under the post and that's a bonus point against first place. That's ridiculous. And they try and do something but they do a forward pass and that ends the game. And we've just beaten Leicester. Uh, I was going to say 28. I think it's 28. 26 or 28. 28 now. That's ridiculous. Beating first place by 28-0 when they haven't lost a game in nine or something. But anyway, we do look at the table. We are still second, but we have we have one more game to well, wait, two more games to play. And I don't think we'll catch them unless they lose both of them. Well, actually, no, they only no, they'll have to lose both of them if we want to actually get past them. But anyway, if you have enjoyed this episode, please give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you very much for watching.